Now, you guys may be wondering, Collins, why do you look like a priest today? And I think we should already know why. Because the things that you guys did in 2019, the fraudulent things that y'all did in 2019 deserves a prayer. All of y'all need to be delivered. I am highly disappointed in everybody. I'm highly disappointed. How could... You know what? Everybody bow your heads because I'm going to pray for you all because you guys are disgusting. Every disgusting. Disgusting. Everybody bow your heads. Let's pray. Bef actually, before we do that... Okay, I ran out of my holy oil, so I have to use baby oil today, so just... It's the same difference, don't judge me, so... Be delivered. Be delivered, amen. Be delivered, amen. Be delivered. Okay. Huh? There, Father God in heaven, I have come upon you today on behalf of the viewers who are watching me right now. Father God, they have committed huge, disgusting sins in the year of 2019. But God, I am here to beg for your forgiveness. May you forgive them, Father God. May you deliver them, Father God. Father God, as they embark into 2020, may you give them the wisdom, the knowledge, the understanding to make good decisions, Father God. Hallelujah. Woo. Mm. Mm. Let all of them, all of them, let they make good decisions in 2020. In the name of Jesus, I pray. For in the name of God, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I hate myself, bitch. I gotta go. Somebody, somebody. <laughs> bitch, I can't. Hey bitch, it's me Collins and welcome back to my channel. Now, as you guys can tell from the title, today we're going to be exposing some of your 2019 secrets. Now, I I'm really disappointed in you guys. I'm highly, I'm, I'm livid. I'm highly, highly disappointed because I, I trusted you guys to do better. I, I, wow, I did not know y'all were this bad. Bitch, I thought I was bad, but y'all. Ooh. <laughs> Honey, I thought I was bad, but y'all are just you disgusting. You should be ashamed of yourselves. Every single you, 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 you in the back and you in the front. Y'all should really be ashamed of yourselves. Not everybody, because some of y'all were good. Some of you guys did what was right. But for the rest of you guys, and you know who you are, you know who you are. You should be highly ashamed of yourself. Wow. I don't even want to waste too much time in this intro, but if this is the first time you're watching me, hi, I'm Collins. Please do not forget to hit the subscribe button down below, as well as turn it on the post notification so you get notified each time I post. Girl, like I said, this is this is our messy family. Dysfunctional as fuck. Um, if you love that, subscribe. We welcome you with open arms. Hi. Mwah, mwah, mwah. Welcome to the fam. This person says, I took my SAT early this year and cheated on it. I just copied off the girl that was next to me. I ended up getting a score of 1450 and got accepted to NYU with a scholarship and I'm currently a freshman in NYU. Okay, first of all, I didn't even know you can cheat on the SATs. I thought like SATs were like different forms like for each student, but that's not even the point of this. You are a cheater! That's what- <laughs> Bitch, you're a cheater! You are a cheater, but bitch, a 1450? That's really good. Okay, I don't even know why I'm giving you props because you cheated. But the <laughs> what's her name? You and um you, Lori and Felicity both need to be in prison. All of y'all need to be in jail together, bitch, because y'all are scams. You call it scam people? Scammers, lock up in jail. I'm reporting you to NYU, bitch. I got your info. <laughs> I'm sending an email. I'm writing a letter. <laughs> now I don't condone cheating, but bitch, 
I mean, what's done is done. You can't undo it now, I guess. But congratulations, bitch. You scamming ass hoe. <laughs> this person said, I filled no not November. I mean, you're not the only one. Don't look at me like that. Do not look at me. I, see, I can see your eyeballs looking at me. Bitch. Bitch. Let's be real now. Let's be real now. You know that some of y'all did not make it through. Some of y'all did not make it through, so don't look at me. I mean, but like, I tried. Like, bitch, I, I was really, I was really trying. Like, I really tried. But bitch, when we got to the 24th of November, <laughs> when we got to the 24th, I just, bitch, I reached my breaking point. I just couldn't do it anymore. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I just couldn't. I just, bitch, I was so close to the finish line. Oh, I was so close to the finish line. It just, mm -mm. Mm -mm. <laughs> she says, my boyfriend and I wanted to spice things up in the bedroom. So for Halloween this year, he decided to dress up in a Trump costume and I dressed up as his wife and we role played that night. Then this bitch says, next year, we are going to dress up as Michelle and Obama and do the same thing. Leave Michelle and Obama. I Bitch, leave Michelle and Obama out of this. This is this. Oh my gosh. This is disgusting. <laughs> there is no way. There's no way this has to be real. Bitch, you dressed up in a Trump costume. <laughs> That's your fantasy? That turns you on? Like that's your type of fantasy in a Trump costume? Okay. Okay, see, the only thing that pissed me off is this bitch said, next year we're going to dress up as Michelle and Obama. Leave Michelle and Obama out of this. They don't want to be part of your shenanigans. They, they want no part in your role play. Leave them alone, okay? Stick to Trump and do that. But leave, 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 Miss, <laughs> leave Miss Michelle and Obama. We don't, they, we, I'm, we don't want it. We don't want it. Oh my gosh. Speaking about Halloween, I was a very iconic character for Halloween, and if you don't follow my Instagram, girl, here you go. I'm Peppa Pig. This is my little brother, George. This is Mommy Pig. And this is Daddy Pig. Peppa Pig. <laughs> I hate, I hate myself, I hate myself, I hate myself. Why would I think, bitch, why would I think about that? Like, why would my brain think of, I, okay, let's move on. <laughs> let's move on. This person says, exposing my mom. My mom accidentally connected her gangbang porno to the living room home pod. She came running out and I was just sitting there on the couch acting like I didn't just hear harder at a hundred percent. I can't. I I'm I I'm I can just imagine in my I I'm trying to visualize it in my head, bitch. Okay, this is funny. It's funny. It's it's hysterical, bitch. My bitch said, I just said they act like I didn't just say hard. Like, Come on, bitch. Okay. First, but by the way, kudos to your mom, cause bitch, she gets down, honey. Bitch, a gang bang. Okay, mom. You bitch, you, you better get it, girl. You better. <laughs> you better get it. This is funny. This is so hysterical. Oh my gosh. <laughs> This person says, I specifically asked my mom for a new Chanel purse for my birthday in May. Instead, this bitch bought me a Gucci purse. Oh, that was out of season. So I got mad and I slashed her car tires. She doesn't know it was me though. Okay, this is... This is rich people problem. <laughs> I can't relate. You got a whole Gucci purse and you're over here pressed. You're upset. R give me the Gucci purse if you don't want it. Give it to me. <laughs> Give me the Gucci purse. Please, goodbye, have a seat. There are way far more important problems to worry about. Not no damn Gucci purse. You and that Gucci purse can have several seats in the back. Goodbye. Get out of here. I'm a single mother raising two kids, and I asked my boss for a raise because my kids and I are going through some financial struggle. 
Big plus, I work hard at my job every day and I deserve a raise. He said he would only do it if I gave him head. Ooh. I had no other choice, so I did. Just last month, I was promoted with a higher paycheck. Okay. <laughs> okay. Ooh. Okay, see, if, if I had read this like two years ago, I probably would have criticized you, but now I'm older and I understand like times are hard. Times are, okay, do, is this right? No. Am I, do I condone it? No. Am I gonna judge you? No. Why? Because I know bitch, it's, it's hard in them streets, girl. Times are hard, especially being a woman. You've got to work 10 times as harder to prove yourself and it's really, it really sucks. It really sucks. And she's a single mother raising two kids. She's got to, homegirl's got to feed her family. She has to put food on the table. And if it means that she has to get on her knees to do so, girl, you can't be mad at her hustle. You just cannot be mad at her hustle. She's, <laughs> she's grinding and sucking. <laughs> she's grinding, okay? She's grinding and sucking. She's sucking. She's grinding hard. She's sucking hard. <laughs> <laughs> okay, she's grinding to make it. She's grinding hard and she's sucking hard, girl. She's got to... You work hard. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. I spit in my mom's Listerine because <laughs> she said I couldn't go to a sleepover. Girl, now why would you do that to your mom? Why would you do that to your mother? <laughs> why would you do that to... Honestly, I'm never gonna lie. This is low-key something I probably would have done like oh, I can't go to a sleepover <laughs> I'm playing. <laughs> I'm playing. That's disgusting. That is disgusting and I feel so bad for your mom. Bad. You bad kid. Bad. 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 Bad girl. <laughs> this person said now like this is actually really fucking disgusting. This person says I found out that I had STD back in 2018 and I've had unprotected sex with about 10 people this year. I really don't care because if I'm gonna suffer, then they can suffer with me. That is just, I don't, I don't know why I'm fucking, I don't even know why I'm getting emotional. That is just so disgusting, like, I can't even fucking look at you right now. I can't look at... That is evil. That is so evil. <sighs> this is... on, Guys, this is honestly why you literally cannot trust anyone. Because, bitch, nobody wants to see you happy. Nobody wants to see you succeed. Everybody's out to get you. And you know what? You can argue and say, well, the people who slept with... The people who slept with should have known better and protected themselves, yada, 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 yada. Okay, that's a fair point. But the, what pisses me off is the fact that you're saying that you don't care and because you're suffering that everyone else has to suffer with you. That's evil. That's fucking evil. And just so you know, there's a special place in hell for people like you because you're go There is... <laughs> I, I can't. I just cannot. And that's why it's so important, you guys. Please just be careful because there are some evil people in this world. There are some fucking evil people in this world. And it's disgusting. This is why I, st <laughs> this is why I don't have friends and I just stay home and mind my business. This is the exact reason why. Because, bitch, I can't trust anyone. You can't trust anyone. You cannot trust anyone. There's so much evil in this world. I'm done. Let's just move on, please. Because I'm just... Okay. This person says, I can't believe I'm telling you this. LOL. But my boyfriend and I had our anniversary early this year and he took me to this beautiful restaurant. I couldn't help but notice that there was a cute waiter who kept making eye contact with me. Long story short, the waiter and I... Of course. <laughs> Long story short, the waiter and I ended up going to the bathroom and we had a quickie. But I could you not, that was the best I've ever had in a while. That is so disrespectful to your man. Oh, bitch, that's gotta hurt. That's gotta hurt. Also, we exchanged numbers, and I really don't know what came over me. I think I had a little too much to drink. Don't blame it on the alcohol, bitch. Okay, what you're not gonna do, what you're not gonna do is... <laughs> you guys, don't you dare. Don't you dare blame it on the alcohol, because you knew it, bitch. Don't, don't blame it on the alcohol, bitch. You knew, you, 
Girl, you knew exactly what you were doing, Rich. You knew exactly what you were doing. Don't you dare, don't you dare blame it on the alcohol. My thing is, this was on the day of your anniversary. <laughs> this is so dis- this is, this is disrespectful to a whole new fucking level, bitch. On the day of your anniversary. Bitch, on the day, and you had the or <laughs> If I was the boyfriend, this would have been an automatic breakup. Like, bitch, don't be mad, don't be upset when you're mad. If, if he does find out, I don't know if he knows, but if he does find out, don't be mad that he breaks up with you. And even if he doesn't find out, just the fact that you're keeping such a secret from him, such a secret like this, and another thing, why did you get the number of the waiter? Hmm. I feel like there's more to the story that you're not telling us. Why did you guys exchange numbers? Oh, I see. I see, bitch. She wants to go back for more. She wants to go back for more, okay? Bitch, I bet you, I bet you she probably eats at that restaurant at least once a week now. Bitch, she goes back to that restaurant at least once a week. She's probably like, babe, remember at the restaurant we went um, on the day of our anniversary? Can we go back there again? Like, the pasta was so good. Like, it was just so good. Meanwhile, she missed the dick was good, girl, okay? <laughs> okay? She missed Mr. Waiter's... <laughs> His ding dong was amazing. She said that was the best she's ever had. She said it. That's the best she's had in a while. Girl, I smell something fishy. I just, some, I, I, I'm okay. I'm not saying anything, but look into my eyes. I see you, bitch. I know what you're up to. I know what you're up to. <laughs> and again, do not blame it on the alcohol because you knew, bitch, you knew what you were doing, bitch. You knew what you were doing, bitch. You knew what you were doing, bitch. Don't you, <laughs> don't you dare blame it on the alcohol, bitch. Get out of here. Get out of here. I had a little few. Girl, you knew exactly what you were doing. This person said, I have over 50 accounts that I use to dislike videos and leave hate comments on people I don't like. <sighs> okay, we're done. We're just over. This is a perfect example of like why people should not care about hate comments because this is what they do. Like that's what they do. They make fake accounts, bitch. You have over 50? Bitch, that means you had to make emails. Like 50 emails, bitch. You must be bored. <laughs> At least, bitch. At least if you're gonna be a full-time hater, because this is a job, bitch. For you to be making all those accounts, this is a full-time career. If you're gonna be a full-time hater, at least get paid, bitch. You're, wor you're working for free. <coughs> you're hating for free. No check, nothing. All right. If that floats your boat, if that what makes you happy, okay. Good luck with your struggle. <laughs> Good luck with your struggle. All right, you guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video. My camera's about to die, so I have to wrap this up. If you did enjoy this video, please do not forget to give this a big thumbs up. And if you haven't already, hit the subscribe button down below as well as turning on the post notifications so you get notified each time I post. Be sure to follow me on my Instagram, which is thatboycollins underscore. See, I've noticed a lot of you guys don't follow my Instagram. Y'all are still being a fake, okay? We're still being fake, okay? We're about to be, we're about to be in 2020, and you still want to be a fake ass bitch, really? That's what we're doing now? Okay. All right. Just know God is watching. <laughs> God is watching. <laughs> but please make sure you follow my Instagram. Everything will be listed in the description box below. Um, until next time, I love you guys. Bye, bitch! <laughs>